Hi, I'm Brad, skipper of Puffin. I'm a long ways from Puffin. Puffin is sitting in Charleston, South Carolina, up on the hard, and is for sale. I'm sitting in Colorado Springs, Colorado, some 1,700 miles away, and I'm setting up a home. Sailors don't often get this far from their boats. And so I thought that even though you're surrounded by gorgeous ocean scenery, you might like to take a break for just a short little while and take a look at some Colorado scenery, gorgeous mountain scenery. The small mining town of Silverton, Colorado, is located in the southwest portion of the state. And people started populating that little mining town in the mid-1800s. But the town really took off when gold was discovered there near 1870, and the miners flocked in. Well, it's hard rock mining, it's not placer deposits, and in order to process the ore, you needed to bring the ore back down off the mountain and process it, and in this case in a nearby town called Durango, also in Colorado. In order to bring supplies up to the miners and bring the ore back down off the mountain to be processed in Durango, a narrow gauge railway was built by a General Palmer in 1881 and 1882. That railway runs from Durango to Silverton, an elevation of 6,500 feet up to just a little over 9,300 feet. It runs about four, a little over 45 miles and is some of the most gorgeous scenery that you will ever see. It runs along the Animas River and through some deep canyons. That narrow gauge railway is still in operation today, pulling tourists up and down the, the canyon. And it's operated, or the trains are pulled, by steam locomotives. There are, I think, a total of seven steam locomotives, and they were built in 1923 and 1925. So sit back, take a look at some of this scenery. It'll be a little bit of a break from that gorgeous scenery about the ocean that you've been looking at.
So if you find yourself a long ways from your boat, enjoy the scenery. If you get out here towards Colorado, I'd highly suggest taking a ride on the narrow gauge railway between Durango and Silverton. You'll really enjoy it. Either way you go, my motto is enjoy yourself. So please, get out there and enjoy yourself.